today we will be looking at hybrid strategy at Town Hall 12. We are going to attack this base with a siege barrack. Firstly, we will clear out this section with the queen. And if we can charge her towards this side, then we can get the enemy CC and the enemy queen. The king and the siege barrack on the other hand will be trimming out this section. Finally, we will shooting the hybrid through the middle. So let's see how it goes. We'll start by deploying the queen. It seems complex, but we can divide it into parts. I'll wait for the queen to take out that air defense. And when this air defense falls, I'll be deploying one Coco Loon. And there it is. Now we will deploy the healers. And there are only two cannons at the queen, so we don't need the rage just yet. We'll deploy the baby dragon here to cut her pathing and make her away with the super wall break. I want the queen to take out this eagle and the enemy CC, primarily. We will raise the queen in a bit and we'll have to make another way here. The baby dragon is going to fall, but it has done her job. And now we will deploy another Kokolo. Another reach, because our queen is going to engage the enemy queen. That's a bonus target. The CC is drawn, so now it's time to deploy the poison spell. We will raise the queen as soon as the previous reach fades. Now the queen's job is mostly complete. We are done with the first phase, so we will trim off this section with the king, a tanking giant, and the siege barrack. A wizard here to make the P.E.K.K.A. not war too much on this side. We'll wait for them to trim the section a little bit more. And then, we can start the hybrid. We'll start with the miners, and when they pop up, we'll deploy the warden, followed by the hog riders. The queen's ability will be auto-used here, because I forgot, but we have our hybrid to pay attention now. We only have two healing spells, so we'll have to make it count. We do not need to freeze that inferno, so we'll save the freezes for a bit. But surely we will need to freeze this multi. The hogs are out from the siege barrack, and now it will be interesting. The king's ability has been triggered, but he has trimmed up the whole section here, so I do not have any complaints. We'll be using the next freeze on the town hall, and then healing all of them together. I think this is a good time to pop the warden ability. We'll try to save the queen, and save the troops from the town hall blast. The queen will fall because we ran out of freezes, but she has done a good job. We still have got a few troops left, we'll deploy all of them here to make the miners push a little bit faster. The pecker is still alive, it's a pecker charge now. The single will fall to the hogs, and we don't need to care about that air defense, so we will deploy those two balloons on that archer tower. They will take care of that, and that wizard tower shortly, and it's going to be a triple. Now let's try the different variation. We will use a flame finger in this one. Firstly, let's start with the queen charge. We'll deploy the queen, the cocoon, the healers. We'll wall break here pretty soon because we want the queen to go in. We do not need to make a solid funnel in this one. The queen should walk in after she destroys this cannon. And there we go. Now we can raise the queen and with that she will be able to take out that inferno and that air defense. We'll start a baby dragon on this side. The CC is lured. We'll poison it. That should take care of all of them and deploy another super wall breaker that will open this compartment. We'll wait for the queen to take out everything and we will rage her shortly. The next target of the queen is the town hall. And when the queen engages the town hall, we will start our flame finger. The queen has done her job. Now we can start the barbarian king. We'll also deploy a baby dragon here that will trim out the section and the barbarian king can stay on the outside. We'll raise the queen shortly, she is about to engage the enemy queen, and now we can start the hybrid from the middle. This is a pretty good funnel. We'll deploy the miners, the hogs, and the warden in ground mode. We'll start with the warden ability, that will save the troops from that giant bomb and the inferno, but we'll have to deploy a heal spell here, the miners are lagging a little bit behind. The flame finger is going good, it's gonna get targeted by this mortar. It's okay at this point. We have another heal spell remaining, I'll be deploying that around that expo. It's going to save the troops from that multi as well. There's that toll into trap, so we'll freeze that multi. We have hogs inside of our flame finger. We can pop that manually, but I would like if it goes a little bit more. The healers are getting targeted, so I'll freeze that expo. And it was a good hit. We still have got the flame finger. It opens now. But there's no need for that, because everything has been taken care of. Now it's simple enough. We start with the queen charge balloon heaters and then wait for her to trim this section i will use one wizard here to trim maybe not wait i will put this archer yes that got it now the queen should 100 percent move towards this side we'll deploy another coco loon and i don't want the queen to go in so i will keep on raising the queen and freezing that single target in front of tower i'll be freezing that in a moment 
I would like the queen to step out of that if or not our range and that air defense as well. She will do that because of the rage and the CC will be triggered. Now this is a really tough CC. If it gets you off guard then you will lose your queen. You will freeze the rocket balloons and poison the super minions. Of course you will have to deal with the CC under rage. And when she deals with the enemy CC most of her thing is done. Now it's time to deploy the barbarian king and we have siege barrack in this one. We will deploy the siege barrack only after deploying the king. On this side we'll deploy a wizard and two giants. We'll also wall break the queen in and freeze that expo. Now it's time to shoot the hybrid. We deploy the miners, hogs, the warden and wait for them to go in. I'll charge the queen towards that single inferno later. This time we will start with a healing spell. Hogs are out and they will be requiring a heal spell as well. The eagle shot is about to come down so we will use the warden ability. We still have got a free spell that I would like to use on the single or the town hall. I think I'll be freezing the town hall so let's use the queen ability here and they got it. There's no poison blast in town hall 12 so it's like a glorified giant bomb. So you do not have to worry about losing so many troops to that. The giga bomb is usually something that you can deal with. Now most of the hogs are out but the miners will be carrying this attack to the third star. Now with that the hog miner hybrid strategy must be very easy to do. But if you want even more easier town hall 12 war strategies, then check out this video. These are exceptionally powerful and easy town hall 12 war strategies. Like this one if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye then.